Uh, I, uh, I had a hard time finding, finding this place today, uh, mostly because I have a GPS that hates me. Uh, I know this because I was driving and it gave me a very general direction. It was like, make a left turn up ahead. I missed my turn. Oops, my bad, whatever. Move on with my life. All of a sudden, though, I hear this. <sighs> Rerouting. Like, you can hear the eyes <laughs> rolling. I don't like that. So I went out and I bought one of the celebrity GPSs. I don't know if you guys have seen these. They're really cool. Sometimes celebrities record their voices, and it's a little robot woman who get a celebrity giving you directions. So like uh, Snoop Dogg, he has one. So the coolest thing ever, you turn it on. Bing! Oh yeah, it's a D-O-double-G. What I'm doing? If I do, he just starts rapping. It's so fun. What you need, little mama? Make a right on the harbor. It's so awesome, guys. It's so awesome. Supposedly there's a Morgan Freeman GPS, so I've yet to find this, and I so badly want it. Because at that point, he's not giving you directions as much as he's narrating your adventure. <laughs> That's fun for everybody. Turn it on, bing! All right, well, here we go. We're gonna journey north now. It's about a three hour drive. Continue on this road to make a left when you see a white oak tree. <laughs> But oh, that oak. <laughs> that oak tree has stood there, well, since the late 1800s. As soon as the test of time, neither fire nor lightning could bring it down. You heard about oak for an hour, haven't turned the car on. You're just like, I want milk, but now I'm watching a documentary. This is great. <laughs> There's certain celebrities I think should jump on the GPS wagon, one of them being like Jeff Bridges, the dude, the big Lebowski. He'd be perfect, right? Chillest person to ever be in your GPS. Turn it on. Bing! All right, man, let's drive. Let's hit the road, dude. Let's totally cruise. He doesn't give you directions. He just talks to you the entire time. Just like, man, the universe will get us where we need to be. Don't worry about directions. We'll get there eventually. We'll get there. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, I have this voice. You guys can hear it. It's real. It's scary. I hear it, too. It's all right. Uh, it's very deep, very bassy. Uh, sounds a lot like I ate James Earl Jones. <laughs> it does. Like, I literally can walk around and just start telling people, I'm looking for my son, Haji. Like, I can do that. I can do that. Simba, with the light touches is our kingdom. That's just going on right now. <laughs> yeah, I've had this voice for a long time. Uh, I'm almost certain I didn't go through puberty. If I did, my balls never dropped. They plummeted. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> oh, damn! <laughs> now, I'm pretty sure I, I'm pretty sure I came out sounding like this. Because my voice has been like this for the longest time, as far as I can remember. I'm pretty sure my parents woke up to a baby crying like, Wah. <laughs> Wah. <laughs> Bitch, I said, Wah. <laughs> It's a very aggressive baby. <laughs> yeah, it was weird also meeting my parents' friends with this voice. And I was a big kid growing up too, so I never looked my age, I was a little older. So I would throw them off and I would tell them my age. They'd go down the line like normal, just like, Hey Timmy, how old are you? Well, I'm seven. Hey Jimmy, how old are you? I'm six. Hey Julian, how old are you? I'm five. <laughs> I'm gonna go play on the swings. We <laughs> baby Dr. Claw from Inspector Gadget. <laughs> Next time, Gadget. Next time. <laughs> Fly away. <laughs> oh man. But it wasn't uh, it wasn't all bad. I don't want you guys getting the wrong idea. It wasn't all bad having this voice. Like the one good thing that came out of it was my parents never worried about me playing outside by myself or getting abducted or kidnapped. Because they knew. Nobody's kidnapping a kid who sounds like this. <laughs> Alright, there was never an ice cream truck outside my house with a guy inside like, Hey little boy, I got candy in my van, you wanna come with me? Why don't you come with me? OH SHIT! He just drives away! <laughs> Before he ends up at the bottom of a well and I'm looking down like, it puts the lotion on its skin. <laughs> guys, my name's Julian, you guys are great, have a great night!